Hello everybody and welcome back to Your Random Adventure. Today I'm at Universal's Islands of Adventure theme park in Orlando, Florida. In my opinion, the best theme park in the world. And today, it is a Saturday in July, meaning it's gonna be crowded. So today I'm going to be testing Universal's single rider line system to see if it could beat the summer crowds, not only here at Islands, but also at studios later on. So, let's get into it. Our first stop is we are going to make a left out of Port of Entry into Marvel Superhero Island to ride our first ride, Spider-Man. The Amazing Adventures of Spider-Man, which has a single rider line. So, let's go. I mean, the regular wait right now is 45 minutes, but the single rider, it doesn't have a designated time, but it should be quick. So the regular wait was 45 minutes, but I actually started a stopwatch as soon as I got in line. And I've currently been waiting 20 seconds. We got on in 10 minutes with a regular 45 minute wait. Single rider really is the best. 10 minutes, 13 seconds, 0.9 milliseconds. Let's go, this is awesome. Yeah! Well, we finished Spider-Man, and that was awesome. We got on really quick. We're heading into Toon Lagoon, and I'm contemplating whether or not I want to do Dudley Do-Rights or Popeyes, but for sure I'm going to make a stop in the UOAP Lounge. I don't know. I don't. Do I want to get wet? Do I not? I'm not sure, I, I'm pretty sure Dudley do -Ride does have a single rider line. The only thing is I couldn't bring my camera on it because um, cause it's not waterproof. But uh, we'll see, we'll see how it goes. So first for me, both Popeye, Olive Oil, and Betty Boop all out here at the same time. I've never seen them all out here before. Right in front of me is the boop -a -doop, uh, Betty Boop area which is also the home of the newest UOAP Pass Holder Lounge. So, let's go. Wow, this place is actually a lot nicer than the other one. Wow. That's actually crazy. They, ha they don't have the pins anymore. That's the most disappointing thing I've ever heard. All right, well, after being utterly disappointed in the annual Pass Holder Lounge, Maybe I'll do Dudley Dura if it has a single rider. I'm not sure if it, it does. Right in front of me, I can see Velocicoaster, but it's delayed. So I probably won't be able to do that either. Well, Dudley Do Right single rider is not currently open. Otherwise, I would have done that. However, there are still plenty of rides that still do have single rider, such as Forbidden Journey, Velocicoaster, Hagrid's, so still have a lot to go. Bye Toon Lagoon, and hello Skull Island. So Velocicoaster's delayed. River Adventures single rider is not currently running. So we're going to head into Harry Potter, Hogsmeade, and we're going to, I'm going to do Forbidden Journey single rider and Hagrid single rider, and maybe just for fun, Flight of the Hippogriff. This couldn't be truer right now, as Velocicoaster is currently delayed. Forbidden Journey is currently a 45 minute wait. Hopefully with single rider, it's even less. Like I said, uh, what was it, Spider-Man. 10 minutes with a regular 45, so this should be quick. To rent a locker, please scan your up? 12 minutes, 44 seconds. Regular 45 minute wait. But now, it's time for Hagrid's. Close. Oh, 
told you, found my missing screws. Best be getting you out of here before you get lost. Ah! Take those purple buttons. single rider attraction currently available so we're gonna head on the Hogwarts Express over to studios and do all these single rider attractions there that are my favorite seconds. Pretty good. Regular wait was an hour and I only waited 27 minutes. So now I'm gonna head over to Men in Black which is the next one of my favorite rides that also has a single rider queue. All right well I do have to pull my camera in a locker but I'll see you guys after. I got 128,675 but it's raining now so. So it started raining a lot but we're good now so I got off men in black it was originally a 20 minute wait it took me two minutes 40 seconds to get on and our last stop is Transformers but first we're here at fast food Boulevard I'm gonna get a crusty burger I just mobile ordered and it should be ready in just a bit all right the crusty burger finally came huge but very good our last stop on testing single rider with summer crowds on some of my favorite attractions is transformers the ride 3d the current wait i believe is around an hour so we'll see how long it takes with the single rider line that was literally a walk-on i mean as soon as I get seated, I will stop this stopwatch. 52 seconds with single rider. <laughs> summer crowds the answer is most definitely yes unless Hagrid's Hagrid's actually because it's only two people it is going to take a little bit longer but other than that we've had pretty much walk-ons all day so yes single rider does help you beat the crowds thank you guys for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed I'll see you guys in the next one bye